Tell, pay attention to the people around you, people, places, and things. You have to do that. You have to look at what's around you, what keeps popping up in your life. And I'm not talking about the negative things. I'm talking about the positive. Well, you know, actually some of the negative things too. Are you great at uh, helping people uh, move to the next level? Are you just a, a very good person to talk to about problems and you don't judge, you just listen? Are you a person that um, is able to sort people's plans out? Are you a good planner? Are you a good organizer? Are you a good person that is a good person that people can come to you and they can vent? They can tell you where they at. They don't know what they're doing. They're confused and they feel comfortable doing it. Do people come to you for advice? Do people come to you uh, for, uh, I know you got a good eye. I want to see if you are, like, what your idea is about this. They want to run an idea by you, you know. Uh, maybe sometimes they'll come to you and they just say, I just like hanging around. You just make me feel so much better. Or you're a person that inspires people, encourage people, make people feel good. Or you're just a kind person, you know. Sometimes, um... Uh, you're a good hospitality person, person who just makes people feel comfortable. When you're hungry, you need some water. You're always making sure everybody's okay. And that's one of your great assets, right? And sometimes we don't see that as a good asset, as an asset. We see it as a, oh, that's just something I do. No, 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 no. Everybody can't do that. Everybody can't do that and make people feel good and comfortable. Some people truly enjoy administrative work. Some people just tr just like to be on the computer and put things in order. Some people like to do filing. Some people like to paint and, and make things colorful and decorate. You know, some people are more about internal and some people are, are more out external. You have to understand that everybody was given a gift. Greatness is in you. I promise you it's in you. You may call it small, but God calls it large. And I want you to understand, he made everybody with something. I mean something. Baby, if you can braid and you can braid out this world, be the best braider. Okay, in your lane. Don't try to be braided like the other girl next door or the girl down the street. or the other. No, braid like you do. Because I promise you, there's a unique way that you braid. That's why people come to you. They say, I don't know, I like the way she braided my hair. I like the way. And then you, know, you can have so many people that cut hair. And some not so great. And then there's some that, you know, hey, they got it going on. You be like, I'm going back over there. He cut my hair good. I love the way he hooked me up. It could be a girl or a man or a woman. It don't matter. You just know one thing about yourself. You got to understand that God has given you a gift. And it's up to you what you do about it. You can't complain. And you can't gripe if you're not using the greatness that you have inside of you. I promise you may can sing. I promise you may beat the drums well. I promise you may be a person who likes to drive and transport people around. If that's your gift, baby, then you get to doing it. And stop playing, okay? Stop playing. There are so many things. Baby, you may be a, a bra slayer, okay? You may be the best eyelash uh, slayer, okay? You may be the first, be, the best face beater, okay? You may even be a person that can hook up some outfits and make a girl look like a million dollars. Make a dude look like a million dollars. It don't matter. You got something that you have a great at. You may be a person that, like to, that is a very good connector, or you may be a person that's a good collaborator. You bring people together. You make things happen. You make, you do events and you do uh, promotions, you do organizational work, you do, you know, nonprofits, you can get them together, you can hook up people for funding, you got some great sponsors, you know how to bring sponsors in and make it happen and show people how to do that thing. You know how to run a business and you know how to show other people how to business how to run a business. And you don't feel so uh, holier than thou and almighty gosh and up above everybody that you can't help somebody. You can help somebody sometimes. We overlook the small things and they are huge. And if you just get on that small thing, it will lead you to the large thing. I'm just saying. Well, this has been Lady Dr. P with another kindness message. And it was all about telling you the truth. Baby, you are great at something. Get on it and make it happen. See you on the next round. God bless you.